Greetings and good afternoon. This is a short tutorial on video editing. So I have downloaded the files for the Cheetos commercial and placed them onto my desktop. Within that folder you will see that there are a couple different types of files. First we have our... It's always very important to keep your files in the same location. If you are working on a project and you don't finish the project and you move your files the platform will not be able to figure out where the files have moved. Files are not actually brought into the software for video editing, but they are sourced from different locations on your desktop or on drives. I would recommend getting a portable hard drive if you're going to be doing a lot of video editing. Within the folder, you'll see that there's sound. Um, this has been sound that was downloaded from a free Creative Commons website and then there are clips which I have labeled from 1 to 9 here. The other thing that you might add to a video is a still image. So you could have another folder with still images but the three types of assets that you can have within video editing are going to be still images, videos, and sound. I have created a cover for the faculty learning community so I'm going to go ahead and add that into my still images folder. I'm going to go ahead and find it on my desktop and just pull it on over into that folder. And now that we have all of our assets organized, we can go ahead and import them into the software. And we can go ahead and do that now. I'm going to go ahead and import the videos into Camtasia. So I'm going to go ahead and open Camtasia. And once I do that, I can click the import medium. Generally, if you are doing screen recordings, this media will already be imported, but since we're using camera footage, we're going to go ahead and import media, and we're going to locate those on um, the desktop in the folder, and I'm going to go ahead and import them all. Before we begin editing, I'm going to go ahead and show you a clip of the commercial we're going to make.